So anyhow, anything, all the tenants or anything, we can manage it from the system DB only. So connect to the system DB SQL console. Okay, system DB SQL console here. In the SQL console, so what we can do, we can execute the one command here. We can execute the one command here. We can execute it here, right? So that command is like, so for creation, for creation of the new tenant database, so what we can do, just execute the one query, create database, then we have to provide the database name, DB name, we have to provide it here. Then system user password, system user, the password, then just to provide the, the password, what is the password you are providing? Just to give the password, the new password, you can provide it here, then execute the query that will be created here. Simple commands, simple, simple commands here, right? So just to use this one to creation of the DB name is called the, suppose like HD1, right? New, so system user password. So then I can say like here, so welcome one here, welcome one, right? Just click on the execute <clears throat> then so new tenant database is getting created here on top of the existing new tenant database is getting created here right so you can see here hdb info so then one more index server will be populated here right one more index server will be cocked. by default we have one then one more index server will be created Ravi, yes. Can we use all tenants the same password? Yeah, we can use it while setting. We can use the all the tenants same password. Yeah, we can maintain it. So see here, one more tenant, one more index server got created. So this is the default index server. This is the one more index server got created. Simple. Now it took the instance number as 04, right? No. Instance number is same. 00, 0 only. But SID is the different. SID is the HD1. Instance number seems to be changed, no? In the port it won't change. Port will change. Instance number won't change. This so is what the was the formula? Port. Internal internal port number will change. But so internal SQL port number will change. index so zero zero the only thing is uh tenant db right so what is the hd1 hd1 we can use it so then system so then welcome one, we can use it. So the system still it's not completed. So that's the reason it's incomplete. The query should be complete. You have to wait. Or I much time it's take a little bit.
So we can go to CD trace. <coughs> Here you can see the DB underscore HD one, which is created now. Let's go to here. So let's check the index server trace. So what's happening here? Just to go to here, index server trace here. So starting up, starting up, starting up. It is doing all those things here. So systems catalogs. So everything is getting loaded. Starting up here, metadata space, metadata. So security, so statistics. So all got 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 separate. So it's creating here. Yeah, it's still it's getting created. Still, it's doing. It's not that much of simple. It will take time. So, That's why SAP introduced this concept actually, the multi database container concept which means multiple databases on one system DB apartment concept they have introduced. Okay. So, if this is complete, then system will accept the connection, then we can able to connect it. So, Still, the query is getting executed. We can see here in the progress bar. In the progress bar, we can see it here. So, what's happening here? In that case, only one tenant. You have the one system DB, two tenants. I want to stop only one tenant database. If you use the HDB stop, all the tenants will be stopped. So then in that case, what is the next command? So then alter system stop database database name so that only one tenant will be stopped. So that is the approach. So this logical questions you may get during in the interview point of time sometimes. So, so be careful, just correctly uh, listen the question then answer it Ravi, this command, 
uh, HTTP name server hyphen reset user system. Hmm. Is that possible like HDB index server? No, uh, no, only uh, I think system DB, only no, system DB. I think it's not possible. Okay, okay. we'll do it. We'll test it now. HDB index server iPhone reset user system. We reset the password in the maybe tenant D for this. Correct. Unknown command communication is. Yes. Can we stop? What is that question? Can we stop the database from studio? From the GUI level, he's saying from the studio level, can we start yeah. and stop? We can do it, right? Salt our system, stop database, database name. That is what we have done, right? Previously. Stopped only one tenant database. Then again, we started using the alter commands. Alter commands, we can use it. Alter system stop. So these commands, we can use it. We, we, we done it previously. Alter system stop database, the DB name. Ravi, probably he's not asking for tenant. He's asking for the whole thing. System DB and tenant DB. You know yes. how we use the HDB yes, start yes, and stop. Yes. Not from the SQL console. Then we can use the so right click on the system DB. So there is yes, that option. is what he says. So stop system. Then entire everything will be gone. We do it. That's How we do the process. SAP MMC like that? He's asking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Can we stop so HDB? Okay. I think this thing tenant creation it takes at least 15 20 minutes maybe it looks right, like right, it. Right, right. okay this may take time Okay, so this is the procedure. We have to do that one. If you want to stop, you can use it. Start, we can use the stop command. Alt or if you want to delete the tenant, so drop database, then DB name. We can use it here. So database will be dropped. So like this, we have to use the command. Okay, drop database, database name. Alter system, start database, database name. Alter system, start database, stop database. So like that, we can use it for creation. We can use the similar databases here. Okay, so this is about for today, and in the next class we'll discuss about the the data provisioning, Hana security part, then backups, recovery, high availability, and uh, and uh, Hana memory management. So these are the things pending. We'll discuss in the next week. Okay. Sorry, everyone. Last question. So, yeah. delete.